Today, we'll be discussing globally hazard labels and how they can be used in regards to chemicals. Here's an example of the GHS pictograms, which include health hazard, flame, irritation, which is an exclamation mark, gas cylinder, corrosion, exploding bomb, flame over circle, environment, and the skull and crossbones, which is acute toxicity. Each hazard label has a description, as you can see. In regards to the pictogram, these are the things that you should be looking for hazard-wise. In regards to chemicals, here's how you can tell which GHS labels are applied. As you can see here, there is an exclamation mark and a corrosion. With the exclamation mark, this can mean any type of irritant, skin sensitizer, acute toxicity, or respiratory tract irritation. The corrosion can mean skin corrosion or burns, eye damage, or corrosive to metals. Each chemical inside of our stockroom also has one of these GHS labels. Using the numbers and the colors, we differentiate which hazards are present in, in the chemicals. Here, you will see two, three, zero, and a dash. This lets you know that it is hazardous with the health hazard, that it is below 100 degrees Fahrenheit for the fire hazard, it is stable for the instability, and for the specific hazard, it is null. Here's an example of a chemical that we have inside the stockroom with the same label attached to the bottle. Each bottle inside of the stockroom is gonna have one of these labels in the back for our knowledge, as well as the students and the TA's knowledge.